In this segment I want to explain the functions of the four dip switches on the 554 series roller cam controller. The uh, dip switches are located in the lower panel, but before we take the panel off I want to make certain that the uh, controller is unplugged so we don't get any electrical shocks. To remove the panel, I just unscrew the two uh, screws on either end and remove the panel. Now the dip switches are located in the left hand side and it's the blue block right here and they're labeled one through four. The first dip switch is designed in the on position so the uh, ORP won't feed when the pH is feeding and the ORP won't feed if the pH is out of range. If it's in the off position uh, both the pH and ORP will feed. The uh, number two dip switch is a called a consecutive cycle and in the off position the controller will have no set limits on consecutive cycles to correct the chemistry but if it's in the on position the factory default is 10 cycles so if the ORP tried to feed 10 cycles and couldn't correct the chemistry the ORP will start to uh, flash you know, in other words it will alert out and not feed it anymore <clears throat> and the same thing with the pH if it goes 10 consecutive cycles doesn't correct the pH that too will flash the uh, number three uh, dip switch is in the off position it's set to uh, feed pH when the number goes above the pH setting and if it's in the on position it uh, is set to feed one cycle if it's below so basically you're just going from acid to base and the number four dip switch if it's in the uh, on position what it does is it renders all the feed pads useless so the number four dip switch in the off position you can use all the keys on the keypad itself but if you want to isolate it so nobody can change your settings you can turn that to the on position and it renders the uh, keypad useless.